What's going on guys? So, small account update. Diluke level 80, weapon level 80. I got to adventure rank 40. There's not really too much to report on because it's just the fucking daily grind, man. It's just dailies. I got really frustrated earlier on stream playing the game because I just, I wanted to play and I wanted to progress and I, I just wanted to be able to play the game, man. Right now I'm held back by resin and I just have to sit back and wait and hope they change it. But what I do want to talk about is the secondary issue, honestly, not nearly as bad as resin, but something I think is really important to the game. And that's the fact that these characters don't exist in the world. It's understandable for some characters that might be tied to different areas, so they might not exist and walk around. But what about Jean, Kea, Lisa, Amber, Zhangling, Dai Luke, Barbara? These characters all exist within the world and have crazy amounts of dialogue but they're not in game man they're in my party but they're not in game what about if every day based on your system clock these characters have their routines right maybe you could find Dai Luke during the day at the dawn winery and at night you can find him in the bar and he might have one or two of these things he might talk about his hobbies if it's raining out when you go to the Don Winery, maybe he has a voice line about rain because it's context, right? Or it could say, hello, you know, it's like, there's so much potential here that I feel is just wasted. You could find Barbara at the Mondstadt Chapel. Maybe if it's night, she could say goodnight. Or if it's like thunderclouds or whatever, man. It's just really hard to see these characters, see all this wonderful voice acting and just have it exist in a menu. These characters are living and breathing within the world. And one of the biggest issues I have and one of the, what really brought this up for me is think about Lin. You find Lin throughout the world and she does, and she has little quests that you can do. It's like, bring me a mushroom or bring me a red meat or bring just little fetch quest stuff. But what if you could go and help Zhang Ling in the world? What if she was down around Juyin Karst? And she's like, you know what I need? I need some Junyun chilies. Can you bring me back like four Junyun chilies? And you could do a quest for her and she could have, you could have a little dialogue and talk to her a little bit and it could be voice acted and it would be great. It would be fantastic. What about getting crystal cores for Lisa? Cause she likes to mess with her little contraptions. Cause that's what was the Venti quest line. And mentioning quests, we can't replay them. I can't watch those beautiful cutscenes ever again. Unless I go to YouTube, man. I want to go through Venti's quest again and maybe make content about it. Maybe make a video and be able to use the issues with Stanley as a traveler in that quest line, no spoilers, and make a lore video about it, but I can't. It's gone, I can't watch it again. And I'd have to make an entirely new account to locally record that shit, and it's adventure rank 36 away. It just seems like such a waste. Venti's not within Mondstadt, you can't find her every now and then. What if like on a Thursday you could find Venti in Mondstadt, peddling about, doing their bard thing, and then find them later that night drinking their favorite dandelion wine within the bar and then Dai Luke is there. Then you could talk to Dai Luke a little bit. Like imagine how fun that would be. You could make it a thing to on Thursday, I'm gonna go hang out with Venti a little bit. I just find it really unfortunate that these characters seem so underutilized and they just don't seem to exist in the world. I could go to Jean's office right now or during the day or any time of day, she's not there, Lisa's not there, the small girl in the library that likes to talk to Hilly Charles is there, but no, none of these characters, all of this voice acting feels so wasted in these menus, man. It feels like such a waste and I really wish they would just add them to be able to just go through and talk about themselves. And that's kind of it for me. Just wanted to talk about that stuff a little bit because I felt I felt it really mattered, you know? And in terms of making other content or making guide content, I don't think guide content is my thing. I'll be honest, there's a lot of other channels like Gacha Gamer or Demon Kim that are doing it way better than I am and doing it with a lot better editing and a lot more finesse. Not to mention, I can't really make a lot of guide content because I, I don't have those characters to make it with, right? So I want to think about what I can do in terms of content that's valuable to you as the viewer, as well as being interesting to me and something I'm not gonna have to sink $8 billion into because I feel like that would be a mistake for me, you know? But anyway, that's about it.
really. I don't have much else to mention. Uh, I'll think of other content I can make for you guys, but there's just not much going on right now. But thank you very much for watching, and hope you have a good one. Bye.